What's up? You know, a lot of people I know really hate their jobs. They're like, oh, I'm underpaid. Oh, I hate going to work. Oh, I hate driving to work. And yeah, driving to work sucks. But imagine driving to work and then driving right into a cow's dick. Someone's job is to get into a cow vagina golf cart and then drive into a cow's dick and let the cow have sex with it. What happens when the cow busts, but doesn't bust inside the cow pocket pussy, he just busts everywhere and it gets on the guy? Cause if that was me, and I got cow jizz on me, I would hop into a volcano and end it all. Oh hey honey, how was work? I made chicken cutlets. How do you think work was? I woke up at 6 a.m. to fuck cows. What? The fuck is this? Imagine your job is to get a garbage can, hold it up to an elephant's ass, and wait for it to shit in the garbage can that you're holding in your hands without gloves. This lady isn't even wearing gloves. In Monsters, Inc., they wore hazmat suits to pick up a filthy fucking sock. And this lady is retrieving shit from an elephant's ass with no, not even latex gloves. What? This is an elephant taking a shit. That shit's the size of me. So if the elephant puts a little mmm into his ass and that shit goes flying, it is bound to hit her hand. And she doesn't even care. I never thought I'd want to hold a garbage can up to an elephant's ass. Yeah, I have no idea what's going on. I don't know if the elephant's constipated. I don't know if he got something stuck up his ass. All I know is this guy has his whole upper body up an elephant's ass. Remember how I just said, oh, if this elephant puts some oomph into it, this lady's bound to get shit on her hand. Well, if this elephant puts some oomph into it, he's bound to blow the guy out of his ass, blow the shit out of his ass, take the guy behind them down, and they're both covered in shit. I understand this is all for science, and scientists have a great passion for their work, but I have a passion for making eggs. Do you see me walking up to a fucking coop and shoving my hand up a chicken for some eggs? Fuck that, I'd rather have French toast. I mean, I'm not gonna complain too much about this one. I mean, he is raw dog and he's not wearing protection, but at least he's not climbing into the bowl and vacuuming this shit up. And at least it's human shit. I don't care what you ate. You will never shit as big as an elephant will shit. Unless you ate another fucking human, and I highly doubt this is Jeffrey Dahmer's porta potty he's cleaning. Yeah, get all up in there and whiff those balls. As a straight guy, this is weird to say because this grown man is about to grab another grown man's balls, but this is probably the job I would take out of all the jobs on this list. Cause when you work in TSA, what are you grabbing a ball sack every six months? If you're fucking a cow, that's a cow every day. If you're grabbing shit out of a horse's ass, you're grabbing shit out of a horse's ass every day. Speaking of grabbing balls, this kid has to be like six years old. When I was six years old, you wanna know what I was doing? I was playing fucking Mario Kart, Pokemon, and Crash Bandicoot. Not grabbing fat Japanese ball sacks. The more I think about it, the more I think the longer I have this little kid grabbing a grown man's ball sack in this video, the more I think I'm gonna get arrested. So I think I'm just gonna move on. I'm gonna sound like a germaphobe, but this guy is sewer diving with Naked! Naked! He's has, he has nothing on! You can't prove to me that he even has pants on because he's fucking chest deep in sewage! Now I'm in a serious crossroads. Do I want to go up an elephant's ass? Because that guy had a hazmat suit on. This guy's raw dog in it. Literally, anything could crawl up his penis and eat it from the inside out. Just think over the years, all the disgusting stuff you've put in the garbage, all the piss, shit, jizz, toenails, blood you flushed. It all ended up on the sewer, and now it's all over this Indian guy's body. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to give a big thumbs up and subscribe, and if I ever hear anybody complaining about their job again, I will beat them with a frying pan. I'll see you next video. I'm out.